everyone, I'm Rivera Charlie, your discussant for today. And I'm Erin Malate, your discussant for today. Our topic for today is about Presidential Decree Number 1006. It is entitled Providing for the Professionalization of Teachers Regulating Their Practice in the Philippines and for Other Purposes was declared by late President Ferdinand Marcos on January 1, 1977. Whereas, all educational institutions shall be under the supervision of and subject to regulation by the state. The state shall establish and maintain a complete adequate and integrated system of education relevant to the goals of national development. Whereas, the Department of Education and Culture has adopted ways and means of overseeing all the educational institutions in the country. The function of the DEC or the Department of Education and Culture has been primarily been towards ensuring that the educational institution inculcate in the studentry love of the country, teach the duties of citizenship, and develop moral character, personal discipline, and scientific, technological, and vocational efficiency. To implement those objectives, the institution have relied upon their teachers whose direct and continuing interaction with the young people and the children make them open for success for the development of proper attitudes among the citizen tree. Whereas, this accounts for the tremendous growth of teaching population comprising the civil service sector alone, more than 300,000 teachers deployed all over the country. To ensure that in the emergency and urgency of teacher recruitment qualitative requirements are not overlooked, it has become necessary to regulate the teaching profession. Whereas, teaching is the only course that is not yet considered a profession. In recognition of the role of teachers in nation building, it is imperative that they be considered as professionals and teaching be recognized as a profession. Presidential Decree Number 1006, Section 1, Title Decree Professionalizing Teaching Section 2, Declaration of Policy It is hereby declared a policy that teachers' education shall be given a primary concern and attention by the government and shall be of the highest quality and is strongly oriented to the Philippine condition and to the needs and aspirations of the Filipino. Section 3. Definition of Terms The following shall be construed as following. Teaching refers to the profession primarily concerned with the classroom instruction. Teacher refers to the all person engaged in teaching at the elementary and secondary levels. Board refers to the National Board for Teachers duly constituted under the decree. Section 4. Creation of National Board for Teachers Co-Chairman Secretary of Education and Culture Chairman Civil Service Commission Member Commissioner Professional Regulations Commission Two members representing the private sector to be appointed by the President. Section 5. Powers and Duties Appoint a set of examiners for every examination who will be determined and prepare the contents of the board examination for teachers. Determine and fix the place and dates of examination. Appoint the supervisors and room examiners from among the employees of the government. Look from time to time into the conditions affecting the practice of the teaching profession. Issue, suspend, revoke, replace, or reissue professional teacher certificate. Administer votes. So that is the end of my discussion. 
my partner Irene Malate will be continue the other section of the Presidential Decree Number 1006. For the continuation of our report, I will discuss the Section 6 to Section 19 of the Presidential Decree Number 1006. So let proceed. Section 6. Qualification Requirements for Examination Applicants No applicant shall be admitted to take the examination unless, on the date of filling of the application, he shall have complied with the following requirements. A. The applicant must be a citizen of the Philippines. B. That he is of good moral character. C. That he is free from any physical or mental defect and that he possesses the following minimum educational qualifications. There are the followings. Number one, for the teachers in the kindergarten and elementary grades, PE ed or its equivalent. Number two, for teachers of, se of the secondary schools, bachelor's degree in education or its equivalent with a major and minor, or a bachelor's degree in arts or sciences with at least 18 units in professional education and number three for teachers of secondary vocational and two years technical courses bachelor's degree in the field of specialization with at least 18 units in professional education section 7 appointment of examiner appointed examiners of the board are recognized authority in the teacher Education. The examiner shall receive a compensation provided in addition to his salary. Section 8. Scope of the examination. Written tests determined by the board. Section 9. Ratings in the examination. At least 70% in all subjects with no rating below 50% in any subject. Section 10. Report of the results of the examination 150 days after the last day of the examination unless extended by the board. Section 11. Issuance of Certificate The board may consider the certificates of ratings, a certificate of eligibility of issue, an entirely new certificate upon registration of the teachers and payment of their corresponding fees. Section 12. Registration. Registration shall evidence that the registrant is entitled to all the rights and privileges of a professional teacher until and unless the certificate is suspended or cancelled by the board for just cost. Section 13. Issuance of revoked certificates and replacement of lost certificate. A new certificate to replace a lost, destroyed, or mutilated certificate may be issued subject to the rules of the board. Section 14. Registration by Reciprocity The applicant shall submit competent and conclusive documentary evidence confirmed by the Department of Foreign Affairs showing that this country's existing laws permit citizens of the Philippines to practice teaching profession under the rules and regulation, regulations governing, governing citizens. Section 15 Prohibition No person shall engage in teaching and or act as a teacher unless he is holder of a professional teacher certificate or is considered a professional teacher under this decree. Section 16. Penal Provision A fine of not less than 1,000 nor more than 5,000 with an imprisonment of not less than 6 months nor more than 2 years or both such fine and imprisonment at the creation of the court. Section 17. Repealing Clause 
all acts, decrees, executive orders, administrative orders, rules, and regulations of parts thereof inconsistent with the provisions of this decree and hereby repealed or modified, modified accordingly. Section 18. Separa separability Clause in case any provision of this decree or any portion thereof is declared unconstitutional by a competent court, other provisions shall not be affected thereby. Section 19. Effectivity. This decree shall take effect January 1, 1977. That's all. Thank you.